Okay, so what we're going to do now is to take our skills with Mediator to the next level and create a drag and drop exercise so that your users are able to move the text boxes and when they get the right text box on the right picture, something happens. Well done. Woman says, well done. If you put it on the wrong one, try again. She'll say something different. Well done. So that's what well we're done. after. It seems quite simple, but actually it's fairly complicated and will introduce us to key concepts in computer science called variables and also assigning events. To begin with, what we need to do is be aware that it's quite complicated, so get things sorted. You can see here that all the pictures and text have been labelled quite carefully. So the Usain Bolt text is called Usain text. The Jessica Ennis text is called Jessica text. It's something that takes a bit of time, but it will save an awful lot of time in the long run. What we're going to do to begin with is simply get it so that we can, or your user, can move the text boxes and that that will change into a hand when they click on it or when they put their mouse over it. That's really simple. Right click on the text, go to the user tab, click cursor here, will when you move into it, it will change it into a hand. You can change that if you want. And when you move out of it, it changes back to a normal pointer. And then the other thing is the standard drag and drop. Now the standard drag and drop will do pretty much what we want it to, but it's a good idea to also click on it and make sure that it will move it to the front or else it could be that it will disappear behind the picture and then you're a bit lost. So get those sorted on all of it. Events, user tab, click cursor here, drag and drop, double click and move to the front. So even though that's quite simple, it's a vital step to get right. So let's get that done first of all, and then when that's happened, we'll be able to go on with the programming because we're kind of in that place. So get this done so that you end up with something that you can test that will do what you expect, which is go over it, turn it into a hand, and then you can move it.